David, Strange you have movie. two movies that will be coming out soon. The first one is the third installment in the Revelation Road series. It's called The Black Rider. Sounds very intense, so yeah. tell us all about it. <laughs> well, yeah, Revelation Road 1 and 2 came out, um, I think, uh, a bit ago, and they did so well that okay. uh, we decided to con continue on in this bizarre franchise um, that's kind of like a Mad Max, okay. you know, meets Left Behind. Um, there's never been any end time movies like these before uh, with biker gangs and all that stuff. And so um, this one's fun. I mean, we have, you know, we had a, it's always fun to get different cast members in. And, and uh, sure. this one has James Denton from Desperate Housewives. Not that anybody watches okay. Desperate Housewives that uh, watches yes. real life. Right. Right. But, uh, um, you know, uh, Kevin Sorbo is in this and, and, um, mm -hmm. and just a, a whole host of just wonderful people. But and you, it, right? And You're I'm in it as well. It? Yeah, I play uh -huh. this guy, this assassin, right, who, who, who's away, trying to get away from his past. Okay. And he was in the first couple you see that he's, he's exactly. really trying to, to change himself yeah. by himself. But okay. he realizes that he can't. Change only comes through Jesus Christ. Right. And uh, and this just uh, this is uh, now the rapture's happened. Mm -hmm. It's post-apocalyptic, okay. and we continue on in the saga. And it's uh, it's a fun ride um, with a really strong evangelistic message. And so it's a high. It sounds like it's a high action mm -hmm. film. Yep. What's your demographic for this? Um, I'm amazed at actually how many people really uh, took to the first couple, you know, okay. um, even women and, and, and the kids love it. There's no doubt about it. You know, that it gives an alternative to, to watching the mainstream action movies sure. where you, where you do have a, a gospel message. And, right. and so many people have, have written in that they can actually share this with their, their, mm -hmm. you know, that they give their sons something to watch their fathers, the, the, you know, right. um, the, the men that probably aren't watching, you know, some of the other Christian fare. Sure. And I, we're so fascinated by end times and the yeah. just sort of the wonder of how it really is all going to happen. And um, so you're saying really that that men will enjoy watching this movie too. And because sure, yeah. it's well done and, and high quality. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah. Right. Okay. I mean, it takes, it, it, it takes, uh, Josh McManus goes through this end times and it's he's basically he, it's like how does a Christian go through this this period mm -hmm. with a background like his okay so, you know who's who was military was sure. a, a trained assassin was all of these things you know and, and obviously there's there's a lot of fights in this movie there's a lot of um, uh, action car scenes like just you know gunplay every, all of this stuff right but in the center of it is redemption okay. forgiveness um, I'm excited to share it with the world. I bet you are. Now, your second film that will be coming out is called Redeemed. Yeah. How is this different from the first one? There's no action in it <laughs> at all. Right? It's a, I mean, it's okay, a movie. Okay, so it's very different. <laughs> it's a movie about faithfulness. Okay. And uh, and I had the privilege to direct it and 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 work on the script from the uh, the bottom up with with Tommy Blaze. Okay. Um, who's a wonderful script writer and buddy of ours at the Pureflix, you know, family. Right. And um, are you acting in this one? I have as a very well? small role. Okay. In it. Yeah. Um, but Ted McGinley stars in it with Terry Copley, uh, um, Grant Goody. It's just, just a, a wonderful cast. Um, and it's basically about this guy who is having this. It asks the question, what is faithfulness? Okay. And this uh, his company is going down his marriage. He's been married for 20 years. Mm -hmm. You know, he has a good marriage. Okay. He loves his wife. But what happens when, when, uh, um, what is emotional adultery? What is, okay. what is, what happens in our mind? Does it really matter? Right. And, and it really takes that, this Brazilian uh, uh, liaison, mm -hmm. a woman, comes from Brazil okay. to buy out his company. Okay. And all of a sudden he starts thinking about her. I see. And, right. and in the church, you know, we don't deal a lot with, you know, Jesus said, if you even look at a woman with lust mm -hmm. in your heart, you've committed adultery right. already. We don't deal a lot with that in the church because it's kind of an, un, it's not a, sure. it's not an easy topic to bring up on a Sunday right. morning or, you know, or even in Bible studies. Um, right. So this movie really takes that head on. I mean, okay. I think it takes it in a really uh, pure uh, way. A family can watch this film, but okay. it addresses some of these issues. Sure. And um, 
And I'm excited that, that I, I believe that people's lives will be transformed and hopefully that it will heal a lot of marriages. Absolutely. Right. So this one is, sounds much more serious, dramatic. Yeah. And the other one is high energy. What's the different kind of coming from your perspective of getting to act in them, um, getting to write them, be behind the scenes? Yeah. How is it different for you with two very different movies? Well, I, I, when Pure Flix was established, our goal was to create content on an ongoing basis, okay. an alternative to what, you know, is out there. Right. Um, that is life affirming, that uplifts and inspires the human spirit. So. Right. I don't want to just do that with, Pure Flix doesn't want to just do that with one, you know, genre. with one genre. Mm -hmm. We really want to do comedies, you know, like great. Me Again, which is a great movie if you haven't seen that. Me Again, Marriage okay. Retreat, you know, we do dramas like, like, um, like Redeemed. Okay. Then we have the actions and we have, you know, we have all different types of genres because quite frankly, we as, as believers are, mm -hmm. are like our entertainment, but we also want to be inspired. Absolutely. And you can't just do one genre. Right. The variety is the such a good everybody. thing. Yeah. And meets people in different places where, where they're, they're at. at. Right. Well, thank you so much. We will certainly be keeping our eyes open yeah. for the premiere of those. And we appreciate you telling us, you, giving us an inside scoop. Yeah. And if, you know, and if people want to follow us on Facebook, the, the okay. Pure Flix Facebook page or, or mine, it just kind of gives a uh, an idea of what we're doing, what we're shooting, okay. and, uh, and what's coming out. That would be great. We'll make sure that we get all of your information and put it on our website so that we have that link. Yeah, perfect. So, great. Yeah. Well, thank you so uh, much for coming. Thank it was you for great having, having you.